Hey everybody, it's P-Dubs. Thanks as always for hanging out upstairs with us and for checking out the channel. So the Legends Core Max received its first firmware update today from At Games. It just got released a little bit ago. Um, I did a video on my channel a couple of weeks ago. I'll have a little card pop up right now in the top corner of your screen, as well as I'll have a link in the video description below. What this firmware is supposed to do is give you the ability to... Um, download and install your pinball games directly onto the device so you're not going to need a flash drive in the future for your pinball games and your flash drive x stuff your pixel kate x stuff all that uh, will be stored on the internal storage on these units these units do have uh geez what was it 16 gigabytes of data so plenty of space for the pinball games now you will need a flash drive in order to get this set up per the instructions sent out by at games we're going to want to use this LCM download manager, but you're going to want to install that onto your flash drive. So, of course, we have a flash drive plugged in. What we're going to do is we're going to navigate over to flash drive X and we're going to set this up as a flash drive X uh, flash drive with at games. So in order to do this on the Legends Core Max, by the way, I have a USB hub plugged into the single USB port on the device. I have a wired Xbox 360 controller plugged in which I'm using to navigate. And then I have a blank uh, flash drive, a blank 32 gigabyte uh, flash drive here. So let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and format it and see what happens here. And it's been formatted. Let's go ahead and mount it because that's your next step after formatting is mounting. Okay, so it's been mounted. Let's go back. We're going to find out whether or not my Legends Core Max is compatible with this particular uh, new firmware that they caught coming out. Now, if it's not compatible, it's going to let us know. I'm going to go ahead and click on it. One-time LCM download. This is the one-time download manager that manages the June 30th over-the-air firmware update. This will also identify a unit that needs a hardware update and provide information on next steps. So let's see if my unit needs a hardware update. One time download manager is one megabyte, requires three megabytes of space. We have 26 gigabytes free. Would you like to continue? Let's go ahead and hit install. Please wait. One time download manager is downloaded and installed. This may take several minutes. Okay, so the application's there. It's been installed. So far, so good. Let's launch the application. And boom, a hardware update is needed to make full use of this firmware's new features. Please contact customer service at uh, atgames.net slash arcade slash contact for assistance. So if you're like me and the Wave 1 orders of the Legends Core Max, because I paid for this one out of my own pocket, Wave 1 Nod Autumn orders last year, well, there's a good chance that you're going to need a firmware update. So I'll go ahead and submit this email and I'm sorry, a hardware update. I'll submit this. I'll submit a ticket to at Games. And we'll see what kind of hardware update we're going to get. I'm assuming they're probably going to have to send us a whole new unit that has the improved hardware that will actually be compatible with this firmware. But now you guys see what it's like. All right, so you're going to click on the link on the email and uh, it's going to take you to uh, At Games customer support ticket where you can open a ticket, you know, pick Legends Core Max, put your name, your email, retailer where you bought it from, your Legends ID, uh, that's your... Um, that's your handle, like for the leaderboards and stuff. So like on P-Dubs Arcade Loft. The user ID on your system, which if you don't know what your user ID is, head on over settings page on your device. Click on device info right here. It'll have your user ID in there, right? And after you get your user ID, you'll be able to put that in this box and then, you know, let them know, hey, I, got, I have a firmware issue, firmware update, and just say, hey, per your instructions, my Legends Core Max needs a hardware update. Boom, 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 you're done. But there you go. That's what you do to get this up and running. Um, and hopefully we'll get our hardware fixed and I'll be able to make a follow-up video in the near future about all this. If you have any uh, comments, feedback, reactions, leave them in the comments section after the video is over. If you enjoyed the update, give us a thumbs up on the way out. And thank you for subscribing.